Hello, this is Tally Andrews and welcome to Travel Daily's Travel Channel. Shangri-La has launched the first property of its new luxury hotel brand, Kerry Hotels. The 574-room Kerry Hotel Putong, Shanghai opened on Friday and will feature an impressive list of facilities including 6,000 square meters sports club, indoor children's playground featuring a two-story high slide and the largest conference and banqueting facilities in the city with more than 7,300 square meters. The Kerry Parkside complex even has its own underground subway station. Following the launch of the new brand in Shanghai, the second Kerry Hotel will be a conversion of the existing Shangri-La's Kerry Center Hotel, which is currently undergoing a multi-million dollar refurbishment. Tokyo's Metro Ginza line will launch new subway trains resembling those used when the line opened in 1927. The new trains, which will enter service in 2012, will be painted yellow with brown roofs, the same as the country's first ever Metro trains, which launched in Tokyo more than 80 years ago. Despite the retro look, the new trains will be brand new models with larger seats than the existing trains. The first trains will be introduced in spring 2012. Qatar Airways has announced plans to launch flights to the southern Iranian city of Shiraz. The airline will commence twice-weekly flights from its Doha hub to Shiraz International Airport on the 5th of June. Shiraz will become the airline's 101st global destination and third route to Iran following its existing double daily services to Tehran and five flights a week to Mashhad. The new services will be operated with the airline's Airbus A320 aircraft, which features 12 seats in business class and 132 in economy. Egypt's main tourist sites have reopened and are safe for UK tourists. The country's new Minister of Antiquities has announced Zahi Hawass confirmed that all of the pharaonic, Coptic, Islamic and modern sites will open again for tourists after they were deemed safe by security police. The Egyptian ministry also revealed that the tomb of Heptaka, Saqqara and Cairo University were broken into during protests in the city and some t items had been stolen from Cairo's Egyptian museum. Marriott, Saga Holidays, Enterprise, Rent-A-Car and p and Cruises have been rated as some of the top 10 companies for customer service in a new UK consumer poll. Conducted by the Institute of Customer Service, Marriott Hotel scored 86% on providing world-class service. In addition, Saga and Enterprise received an 85% score and p and Cruises was rated at 84%. Carol Marlowe, Managing Director of p and Cruises, said its customer service had helped it secure a high number of repeat bookings. And finally, today's news, Ryanair has operated its inaugural flight to Tenerife from Robin Hood, Doncaster, Sheffield. Following the launch, the airline is due to triple the number of seats on offer from the airport with a number of new routes for the summer, including to Faro in Portugal. Mike Morton, the airport's director, said that the following Ryanair's previous launch to Alicante, the airport anticipated the new routes to Tenerife and Faro to be a similar success story. And that's it for today. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you again tomorrow.